What's up, ladies and gentlemen? We are back with some more Larsenauts gameplay, this time with our favorite speedy starter character, Kalima. Uh, the loadout I'm using today is going to be the doubled standard machine gun pistol, the parkour dash, which gives me a dash charge when I grapple, and the OC absorption. Uh, if you don't know what her abilities do, her dash will propel you a short distance, the temporal rift will speed up your fire rate and slow down the enemy's fire rate, and the smoke grenade creates a smoke screen. Pretty self-explanatory. Let's go ahead and get into a game and get it started. Alright guys, we are in a game. Let's see what kind of damage we can do. Starting in 9, 8, 7, five, 6, 5. Four, three, what he's saying. Two, one, Let's go. go! Okay, so we're going to be capturing objectives. Pretty standard game mode. So, you got a good look there at what her smoke screen can do. The enemies inside it cannot see, but you can, of course. Let's see if we can take C over here. Looks relatively unpopulated. Hi, Thal. Hello. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Back up to B. Oh, hi. Okay, so, he's not gonna get me with this. He can try. Nice try, buddy. Bye. But you can't mess with Kalima. Hello. From him. That's okay. That's what our first, maybe second death. We got this. Don't let them capture that point. So, like I said, her temporal rift will basically give your allies a greater rate of fire, and any Great. Now enemies who walk into it, their rate of fire will be lower. So, I uh, fight. <clears throat> I'm sorry, I shoot faster, they shoot slower. Nice try, buddy. Those invisible traps. Yeah, right. I like how nobody is even trying to go for B. Maybe I should probably go take that. They're all fighting over A over there. Or you think you got shit on me? Nope. I'm there. You can't see me, I'm John Cena. Oh hi. <laughs> Did not even notice. It's okay, let's get it going. We're tied up. How are we tied up right now? Nope. Sup. Sup. Ah, She out at me. I like to use my dash as a method of trying to stay out of people's line of fire rather than just kind of dashing about. I know I just did it there, but... I try to keep at least one in reserve just in case I run into an enemy. That way I can dash out of their fire rate real quick and hopefully confuse them, trip them up a little bit. I feel lonely. I feel like I'm going after everyone I Come here. You can't hide from me. I don't give a shit about this. I'm just in it for the points. I don't know, I guess she's going to stay there today and she would regain her health, but... Hi! I 
see you, Evander. I'm there. Or I saw you. Where'd you go? That's okay. I had already been hurt a little bit. Oh, look. Roblin is claiming now. I honestly can't wait until they add some more characters and we don't have to worry about everybody in the team playing the same person. Because that just kind of... It's a little irritating, honestly. We're gonna lose that fuel. So, I don't know if, like... You and the enemy putting down your temporal rift cancels it out or not. Oh, I thought you were an enemy. Nope. That's okay. We got this. Let's see, is there anything I have not shown off yet? Um... Parkour dash, maybe. I'll go ahead and give a little well, example of that. Or maybe not. Okay, I guess we won. This is a glitch I'm really not a big fan of, to be honest with you. If you are in the player selection menu when the game ends, you're pretty much stuck here, and you don't really get to see, you know, what you earn from the match. You just gotta kind of wait until all that's over. Or return to the lobby. But... I mean, I don't want to have to return to the lobby to check my stats every time. I sometimes like to stay in the same lobby and play with the same people for multiple games. I don't know, it's something I hope they fix soon, among a lot of other things. Alright guys, so there's a little bit of an example as to how I play Kalima. Once again, I just want to thank everybody for 50 subscribers. You guys are the best. I have launched my Patreon, finally. It was what I was waiting for. And if you all are in the Discord, you can definitely get some extra disc, uh, some special Discord roles, as well as some bonus features, behind the scenes content, and even free access to free entrance to giveaways when we have them. In fact, I'm planning on doing the first giveaway at 100 subscribers. If that's something you're interested in, make sure you hop into the Discord, and we will have a discussion as to what we want that first giveaway to be. Personally, I'd rather you all kind of decide on whether or not it'd be a game code, a piece of hardware. By hardware, I mean head straps and whatnot, etc. So make sure you jump in the Discord and let me know. I'll see you all in the next one. Make sure you like and subscribe if you enjoyed, and check out the comments below. I'll see you in the next one.